methods of training. The first method, possibly the most important method, is the max effort method, an ability for the body to learn how to use maximum resistance and strain against weights. The next big thing that the max effort method teaches is maximal motor unit usage. The next method is the dynamic effort method. Force production means that you can get stronger and stronger and stronger, but if you actually don't get faster, the dynamic effort method is much, much harder to use in coaching because everything happens so much faster. It's harder to see mistakes when they're quick. The shorter rest periods are present is we can actually increase fitness level. So what we like to do with the dynamic effort method is we like to keep the rest periods very, very short so we can maintain high velocity even in a fatigued state. The last but not the least method is the repetition effort method. But the repetition effort method is used for hypertrophy. It emphasizes weak points. This is the other thing that you need to understand is like the only way you're going to recruit maximum fiber is from maximal fatigue in the repetition method.